All right, fat. I'm gonna show you how to hit the spot. Show me how it's done. to you from the prestigious Goat Trap Golf Course Country Club, it's putting Green. So what you been doing, fam? I've been spending way too much time fishing. My, my short game's not too good right now. I've been hitting lots, lots of bad shots. Kind of thing, I know you got the short game expertise, so I've been hitting lots of shots. I've been around the green, you know, get up there. It'll kind of look like some of these old weekend hackers. I've been hitting lots of, lots of shots like that. Man, that's not too good. That's kind of fat, isn't it? It's pretty fat. What am I supposed to do, then? Well, let's show you. There's a couple things that you need to do trying to chip the ball close to the hole. Okay, what's that thing? A lot of people like trying to hit that ball really, really high. Man. Well, that's oh. not very efficient or effective or any of those other really yeah, big ones. Yeah, not, not too. Oh, yeah. So then we're gonna do three things to get you in a better shot. Three keys. Oh. Three keys. Three keys. Okay. Back foot, where the ball goes. Shaft points to the sky. Wait on the front leg. All right. Small back and three. All right, that's what you got, fine. All right, here we go. I think I noticed something else. You're pretty consistent about hitting the same area every time. That's right. Once you got your technique down and your fundamentals, we're gonna start looking at a spot on the ground. You gotta hit a certain spot every time it'll roll out, right? That's right. Okay. You gotta hit the right spot. Gotta hit the right spot. So I'm gonna look at a spot. Now, I got me one of them sand wedges, which I had earlier for lunch. I think this one's gonna be about halfway between me and the hole. Okay. I got about six steps there. I'm gonna try to hit it about three. So, oh. practice this. I bought one of Mama's good kitchen towels. Oh man, Mama's gonna be mad then. And I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna put it about three steps away, about halfway to the hole. Here we go. All right, one, one two, two, three. three. Thing, you had to take your shoes off to count that high. <laughs> Not this time. Not that time, yep. So now about three steps. Three steps. And I got about three more to the hole. Okay. All right, so now I'm looking at my mama's dish towel. Yep. Trying to hit that ball right there on top. Okay, well, I got you. Like that, man, I almost hold it out. Okay, I see it rolls out almost the perfect distance. That's right, every time. Okay, so let me try this. Let me make sure Let's this is right. Let's see what so, thing first, I got to line the ball up with my right big toe, right? Right big toe. Okay, right, right big toe. Mm -hmm. Then I got to lean the club a little bit forward, like so. That's right, keep that shaft pointing to the sky. Okay, to the sky. And then what else? Got to put the weight. Oh, right yeah. Right okay, yeah. get the weight. I don't have no problem putting the weight forward, that's for sure. All right, right. So line up. And then I got to hit the spot, right? Hit the spot. Hit the spot. A little something like this, okay. Oh, baby. Man, that's pretty good. That's better already. Not bad, not I'll bad. take that, okay. I see what you mean, then. All good. Right. All right, any other advice you can give me? Yeah, we gotta have choices around green. You don't have to have the sandwich every time. Okay. Right. Yeah, I like a sandwich. It's just a pitching wedge. Pitching wedge, okay. Pitching wedge. Let's see what you got. Then, what's the difference between the sand wedge and pitching wedge? Pitching wedge just goes a little bit lower. It gets the ball on the ground a little bit sooner and rolls just a little bit more. Okay, so it's got less loft, so a little bit straighter face. That's right. Won't get the ball as high in the air and it'll roll more. Makes sense, okay. So what do you have to change with your spot? Spot's gonna be closer to you because that ball's gonna roll just a little bit more than the sandwich. I got you. All right. All right. Well, let's see how that works. So, with the pitching wedge, we're gonna change your spot. We got six spaces. Pitching wedge, it'll be about two of those spaces, and then we're gonna roll four. It's about a one to two fraction ratio. One to two fraction ratio. Okay. Right. All right, here we go. So, move my towel back just about a step. Okay. So, fly in the air about two yards. Two step. Yep, yep. yep. Two step. Yep. Ball back, okay. hands forward, weight forward, hit the spot. Oh man, that's easy, thing. Man, pretty low too. Probably a lot lower than you've been hitting. Yeah, without a doubt. I haven't been hitting it very good at all. Let well, me try that. With the pitch all right, let me try. All right, so same thing. Ball in line with Bigfoot. That's right. Handle up to the sky. That's right. Wait forward. 
hit the spot. The other spot's close because it's pitch wedge, not sand wedge. Okay. That's pretty good. Oh. Hey, a chip wasn't that good in months, then. Well, there you go. Now you got something to use. Well, hey, then, I appreciate it very much. That's yes, a good sir. lesson. Yes, yes sir. sir. Yes, sir. All right. So, I think you got another thing to show us here pretty soon, too, right? That's right. All right, fat. I'm going to show you how to hit the spot. Show me how it's done. Oh, yes, yes sir. sir. Man, that's a that's a phenomenal thin. Good job, man. In the hole. Every Good time. job. Thank you for teaching me how to chip today. Yes, Great sir. shot, thin. That's the way to do it, man. Yes, hey. Sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. So that's what we love about golf. You can be fat. And thin. Play good golf. If you practice hard enough and you do what? Thin? Gotta hit the what? Hit the spot. Hit the spot. That's, that's right. The hole. Coming to y'all from the prestigious Goat Track Golf Course Country Club in Putting Green. This is Fat Thin. Oh, have right. a good night. We're out. Thank y'all.